I'm Chris Crollo, and I've been selling the dream of island ownership for almost 20 years. And after helping so many clients find their island, it's finally my turn. My business partner, David Keener, and I decided to buy an island and transform it into the world's most private island resort. It's finally time for me to make a trip onto Gladden Key off the coast of Belize and see where things are at. David. Welcome back. Wow. This is beautiful. You have done a fantastic job. I'm almost in tears. Seriously? A, a lot has changed since your last visit. The helicopter flight over, you could see the green reef, and then we're landing right on it. That's what it's all about, right? Endless view, barrier reef, second largest in the world, stone throw away. This structure is just perfect in terms of size, and you could see the water all the way around. This is amazing. Imagine how our guests are gonna feel on this island. If they can't relax here, they're not gonna be able to relax anywhere in the world. Let's go tour the island. I wanna see everything. See the pool? What do you think? It's coming together. It's the perfect size for two people, four people. It works. We didn't really even touch this part, so you've still got beautiful natural beaches interwoven with mangroves. And there's so many islands in Belize that have those big sea walls that don't no. look natural. And Gladden has mangroves, lots of wildlife. This is a beach. Not too big, not too small. Perfect slope right into the water. Walk right out to some of the most pristine snorkeling. I mean, the water is crystal clear. 200 foot visibility out here, right next to the reef. You know what I haven't shown you yet is that beautiful palapa and dining room. I saw it from the helicopter. Let's go see it up close. Let's do it. The idea was that our guests don't see any other guests and they also don't see any staff. So how do they know if the staff are on their way over? When the staff comes over to the island, they hit the dock, they press a button, the lights go to red. When they leave the island, they go to green, meaning there's nobody on the island but the guests. I absolutely love it. I know we're close to the reef, we have protection from that. But in a storm, we want the most protection possible. So I had, from Florida, high velocity, hurricane shutters, custom made. Show me. Nothing wrong with a little bit of extra protection. To think only seven months ago, this island was completely untouched. It's been a long seven months, but we're almost there. Just a few more finishing touches on the inside. We got the interior decorator coming just to put the last things yep. in place. Take a look at that. This is what the living room and the bedrooms are gonna look like. It's beautiful. The decorator did a great job of using a very, very high-end Belizean artist basically to hand make what 75% of the furniture? Oh, I think even more. The vibe it gives out is really kind of fits with the whole place. I know you were a little bit concerned about the size of the island, but I mean, the way it's all come together, scale is key. You can walk all the way around the villa, you've got beach everywhere. And now, with the work you've done, this is truly the most beautiful, most private island I have ever seen. To friendship and the world's most private island. Cheers. <laughs>